Hello everyone, just Yoshi if I went back with more paper right there out your door. Okay, this is sort of like a miscellaneous episode. I'll be gathering all this covering all the star pieces that I missed during the main quest, also be covering ZST's recipes. The first star piece I'll be covering is this one behind this rock, next to the pipe on the moon at least the Exxon Fortress. Next we go to um, Creepy Steeple. There's the star piece behind all this furniture here. This is the room where we got ZST's second cookbook. Okay. Alright, and there should also be a star piece behind the fence that leads to Creepy Steeple right here. Yep. And well, just... <laughs> okay. Um, okay, there's also a star panel here in the parrot room where this parrot told us Stolpus' real name. Squawk! <laughs> There's also a star panel here in the movable staircase that leads to Dopeless' room. Creepy steeple. There's also a star piece behind this wall here. This is after the air duct suite sequence where, where, where you go when you first go to the parrot room. And now in Twilight Town, if you shake these bushes, one of them has a star piece. It should be right next to where um, we meet Vivian, where she joins the party for the first time. And there's also a star piece behind this house, which is next to the Merrick's house. And that's a lot of times the houses. Oh, uh, I guess we're getting a little bit off topic here, but since I showed all the other emails, might as well show this one. This should be the last email we get. It's for the last side quest um, email. Got a piece of Kai lost his throat. Ah, so hey, I was happy that you caught me that honey candy. My voice came back and everything. Maybe I was a little too jolly. Started shouting and <laughs> he lost his voice again. So yeah, there may not be much here in Far Outpost, but at least we got snow. Yeah, we have snow palm fights here. The tiny bombs inside our snowballs, but they hit, which makes they hit when they ex they explode when they hit, which makes it super fun. Oh, which makes it super cool, which makes it super illegal, which is pretty lame. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. Okay, back on the subject, there's a star panel here in the tutorial fight where we fight fought the Goombas. There's also a star panel here in front of the first cursing chest in um, the sewers. <sighs> Man, I always forget about this um, on my playthroughs. If you go, if you go back to Flurry's room. Um, you get a super appeal key, which is why I always forget this, is when you first come to her house, even after she joins the party, you can't enter this room until you leave the house again. But anyway, we need to come back here anyway for a star piece. There you go, star panel, um, in, in here. And so on the far east side of Petalburg, um, if you round pound right here, you get a star piece. This is right before the path that leads to Schwung Fortress. And, and, oh yeah, that's not a star piece, that's a turtle leaf. And, and in the second room where you have the puny squad, um, you, find, you can find a star panel here. Okay, yeah, I think that's it for a while, though. But... Okay, in this blue cell, we also have a star panel. And this is where the majority of the punies were being held. Okay. And here, this is um, the room immediately after you start chasing Rodos, you find a star piece in one of these bushes. This is where you fought those two Exnons during the time battle. And um, in the original pipe that leads to the um, second chapter, you find a star panel, which gives us a star piece. And we won't really have a way for the next one. Okay, all the way up here in event shafts, for um, the sub-level 2 of the Exxon Fortress, if you go all the way to the left, you should find a star piece. This one annoyed me because I literally had it in my notes in that chapter, but I forgot it. Okay, so if we go to the star panel here behind Zesty's house, we'll find a star piece. Again, I don't know how I forgot this. And in, um, in Glitzville, if you go on top of the juice shop, there should be a star piece under the Rockhawk sign. You can use Coop Shell or you can use Tube Mode. Your choice. And there's also one behind the phone booth. I forgot. I can't believe I forgot that one. And there's also a star panel on the south side of Glitzville right there. Uh, where's the next one? Oh yeah, um, in Petalburg, right next to Bulber, Bulborb, there's a star panel. And <laughs> I had to go all the way back there, so embarrassing. There's a star panel in the main room to Glitz in Glitzville where you saw the fight with Rockhawk. Well, the room before that, anyway. And there's a star panel next to the blue pipe that leads the far outpost. And, okay, this one's kind of out of the way. It's, it's the room right before Goom Goom in that side quest. Uh, there's a star panel right there, right next to the boat panel. I said a lot, that's a lot of panels. <laughs> and, again, I, I made so many trips to Glitzville for this video. Uh, there's a star panel in the storage room. Okay, now this one... How do I explain this? This is in the room where you fight the blooper during the prologue, a boss fight. If you use an ultra jump and you hold onto this pipe and go all the way to the right, drop down, there should be a pipe, and inside that house is right in plain sight, there's a star piece. Okay, so I think that's about everything. So I think we're finally ready to take on recipes. Alright, let's do this. 
Alright guys, so before we get to the recipes, I think it's probably a good idea if I tell you where the ingredients are. Okay, good. So in the Roquefort shop, you'll find a mushroom, honey syrup, and fire flower. Now, I should also note that, um, you're... In the later part of the game, the Super Luigi, um, books take place with the mushroom, so you're gonna have to buy the first, um, well, not the first, the five volumes of that, if you want, if you want a, um, the mushroom to get, to be, um, sold at the Rogue, po Rogue, Rogue Board shop again, or you can just go to, um, Petalburg, the Petalburg shop there, um, if you want to buy the Super Luigi books. Okay, and also on the west side of Rogue Board, in that, um, shop you, need, you, you go through to get to Don Quinta, you can also, um, buy a Volt Shroom and a Super Shroom there. In Petalburg, um, if you go to the mayor's um, house, um, well, his house is Gar, and you find Curly Leaf there. And if you go to his shop there, you also find a curd shell. Now, the horse tail, I don't remember if I said specifically in a walkthrough, so um, if you leave, if you leave Petalburg going west, you should go to, you should get to a screen with the, with the bridge. If you go um, west one more time, um, you should see like these spike things right immediately when you enter the area. If you hammer one of those and it goes up and down, if you do that, if you do that one ten times, it'll spit out a horse tail. Um, and like I said in the side quest video, you um, drive banquet, talk to um, Bulburb after you do a side quest to, to get it um, like um, dried banquet. Uh, okay, another. Oh yeah, parlor. You can get cake mix there. I um, said that many times from side quest, side quest videos. So I don't think I need to go over that again. And of course, um, again another side quest item. If you go to the great tree, um, do um, Petunies, um side quest. You'll you'll. Um, well, not, it's not a side quest. It's that you just um, answer a question. Mario likes which person the most. She'll give you a mystic mystic egg. Okay, now for the Glyph Pits um, recipe ingredients, um, the, a point swap is shown at the. <laughs> is sold at the shop there, and hot sauce is also. Um, can also be bought from the businessman until you do his side quest. Finally, if you go to Twilight Town, you can get maple syrup, which is surprisingly hard to find. Um, I mean, no, they always sell it. I mean, I, I was surprised how, um, how hard it was to find that in the shops. Uh, if you also, if you rest at the inn, they, they'll give you a peach, and um, you can also get a gold leaf at Creepy Steeple, which I already showed during the side quest video, so, uh, so there you go. Um, key Hall, Key, Coconut, uh, how do I explain this? The bri the giant bridge on Key Hall Key, where um, where, you, where you meet Bobbery after after he's lost. If you go down and then um, jump across the platforms, you get to the pipe. You'll at least to the coconut tree. That's where you get coconuts. And Key Mango, I believe I already um, said that where that was multiple times. If you just hit that one tree next to the blue war pipe. Uh, you'll get you Key Mango. Finally, uh, let's find. Oh yeah, Poshley Heights. Um, you, there's a pasta stand next to the hotel, so that's where you get fresh pasta. Far Outpost, um, that store there actually holds a lot of good items. You can get Ice Storm there, you can get uh, Shooting Star there, and get Ruin Powder. So, and Underground Shop, um, in that area that where Dazzle is, uh, and where um, uh, where the Fortune Teller is, you can get a Slow Shroom there for fairly cheap. You can also get an Ultra Shroom and Jam and Jelly there, but I do not recommend doing that. I would recommend going talking to the merchant outside of the Rogue Board shop. Uh, you know, the guy next to the news. Just enter and re-enter the area as much time as you want until he starts selling Ultra Shrooms and, je je and Jam and Jellies. Because he sells those for 120 coins, and if you try to go to an underground shop, they sell them for 200 coins, which is a complete ripoff. So that's going to cost a little bit of time. Um, what am I talking about? Yeah, my it may take a little um, about 30 seconds or so before you can, before you can actually get the item you want, but it will save you a lot of coins in the long run. Okay, and that's where all the ingredients are. So that just goes to the now that just leads us to the recipes. Oh, Mario sleeps over there. Okay, shroom fry. That's just mixing a mushroom with, or a super shroom. Um, shroom roast is a live shroom or slow shroom. And guess what? A shroom steak is by mixing, um, well, mixing, cooking an ultra shroom. Okay, the next nine are just mixing the mushrooms with the syrup. So you, this is um, honey by mixing a mushroom with honey syrup, and then goes mushroom, mushroom maple syrup, and then mushroom jam and jelly, and then super. Um, 
honey, uh, maple, jam and jelly, and then finally ultra is ultra with the honey, ultra with the maple, and ultra with the jelly. Cool. Okay. This dinner is mi mixing a mushroom with a horse tail. This special is ultra shroom with a slow shroom. Um, this deluxe. Okay. Uh, what was that again? Oh yeah, golden leaf with whack a bump. You can also do it um, with a. Um, one sec, I haven't written down. You can also do it with an ultra shroom and a fresh pasta. Uh, if you don't want to use whack a bump, spaghetti. That's just by mixing fresh pasta, coop pasta, fresh pasta with turtley leaf, spicy pasta. As you can probably guess, it's fresh pasta with hot sauce. Ink pasta is by mixing fresh pasta and inky sauce. Uh, spicy soup is by cooking a fire flower. Uh, fried egg by cooking a mystic egg. Omelet meal by mixing a mystic egg with a horsetail or a mushroom, either or. Koopa bun you can make by make, mixing a curly leaf. <sighs> They're gonna kill mango. Um, healthy salad, curly leaf with a horsetail. Eat your meal. Shooting fry with a shroom fry. Couples cake by mixing a snow bunny with with a spicy soup. A um, uh, uh, mouse, uh, whatever. Make cake mix. <laughs> Just cook, cook, cook cake mix. Um, a shroom cake by mixing mushroom with cake mix. I think probably this. Uh, choco cake is by mixing cake mix with inky sauce. Harful cake, um, by mixing cake mix and ruin powder. Uh, fruit buffet, by mixing a keel mango and a peachy peach. Mango delight, by mixing a keel mango with cake mix. Um, love pudding, mystic egg with a mango delight. This cookie, cake mix, gradual syrup, shroom creep, crepe, excuse me, um, ultra shroom cake mix. Peach tar by mixing cake mix with a peachy peach. Um, turtle, uh, hoopy tea turtle, it is by steeping a turtle leaf, and SST is by steeping a golden leaf. Okay, here we are with the broth. The shroom, shroom broth is um, slow shroom with golden leaf. Uh, fresh juice is by steeping honey syrup. Inky sauce is made by um, mixing hot sauce with curly leaf. You can also um, make it by uh, mixing hot sauce with fresh juice. Random stuff there. Okay, honey, icicle pop. Mixed by mixing honey syrup with an ice storm. Uh, zest frap, frap, uh, whatever. By mixing a maple syrup with an ice storm. Oops, so bunny. So bunny is golden leaf with an ice storm. Cocoa candy is coconut with cake mix. Honey candy is honey syrup with cake mix. And jelly candy is dun 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 dun. Jammy jelly with cake mix. Alright, go figure. Electro pop, cake mix with a full shroom. Fire pop, cake mix with a fire flower. Uh, uh, space food is by mixing a dry banquet with various foods. Um, just to be on the safe side, I would do a um, dry banquet with a mushroom. Poison shroom um, is a slow shroom with inky sauce. It also works if you use a slow shroom with a point swap. So there you go, trial stew. Um, when it says yield incredible results, that means it drops your HP and FP to zero, so... <laughs> yeah, by uh, mixing Kevl's cake with a poison shroom. Yeah, sounds delicious. Courage meal, he actually tosses his enemies. I don't know why, anyway. But mix it by mixing a courage shell with zest dinner. Good enough for me. Okay, coconut bomb by mixing a uh, coconut with a fire flower. Get an egg bomb by mixing a mystic egg with a fire flower. And the piece of resistance. Zest dynamite by mixing an egg bomb with a coconut bomb. And last, but definitely least, is mistake. Um... Yeah, just by made by mixing stuff that doesn't cook. Um, I made it by mix uh, by cooking a fright mask because it was it was in the store next door. So there you go. Okay, so hopefully that wasn't the mo most boring four minutes of your life, but there you go. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, there's only two things left to do: is completing the badges and completing the pit pattern trials. But since you get a few badges down there, just to make it easier for me to categorize, I'll. Um, I'll do the Pit Iron Trials first, and then I'll cover any other badges that we may need to get after that. I don't think so. Um, if not, we'll do, I'll probably just show up in the badge shop. So, But anyway, we'll cover that later. So this has been Vyoshi 5 with Paper Mario Thanos out your door. And, well, final few videos coming up. So, thanks for watching again, guys. Um, please rate up and comment if you like. Um, that would be terrific. And I'll see you next time. Peace out.